I see a fish down there. Oh my God, a fish already. I got it. Ah, there goes the trap. There was something in it. Who's in there? <gasps> no way. Look at the wake. There was something big. It just came up. What did we just catch? Oh my God, it looks like an eel. Oh my God. <laughs> that is its mouth. There's a crab, Helen. Ow, it's pushing me. It's purple. He's chasing us right now. That's security. You guys, I think this fire eel is blind. What is that? <gasps> what is that? What is up, BFP Nation? Welcome back to another awesome video, guys. Today, we're going to be exploring some new sewers in search for aquarium fish. Now, I know what you guys are thinking, okay? We do a lot of sewer fishing on the channel. It's like one of my favorite pastimes, okay? I love sewer diving. And we always catch really cool aquarium fish. However, tonight, we're switching it up a little bit. Now, as you guys know, if you watch any of my videos, these are the sewers that we usually fish. And don't get me wrong, they're really good, okay? But tonight, we're doing something completely different, and I'm really excited to see if we can catch some really cool fish. Now, right here, okay, we're in the road right now. We're in the middle of the Road. And I'm sure you guys have seen these types of sewers like driving around, walking around. Now, I don't know where they connect to, but they're in the same area that we catch really cool fish out of the other sewers. So I'm thinking maybe we try our luck tonight and try to stick a net in there, try to place a fish trap and see if we can catch any fish out of them. It's going to be a complete mystery, okay, because we've never done this before. Like I said, we're in the road right now and uh, we're going to see which is better, okay? The ones we normally fish are these because these look pretty juicy. I mean, if you look in there, there's actually water. So if there's water, there's, there's fish, right? I mean, that's usually how it goes. And I think we're going to do a little competition, okay, to see where we can actually catch the most fish, the coolest fish. I brought three fish traps with me. We're going to place one in here and then one in the normal sewers we normally fish. And yeah, I'm really excited, guys. So we're going to get started. I don't honestly know how we're going to do this because I don't know how these work. I don't know if we could just lift this up. There's one across the street as well. I mean, like I said, they're everywhere. So maybe we'll fish both of these. Yep, there's water in that one too. Oh, that's nasty looking. Jesus, that's disgusting. Okay. So yeah, guys, sewer fishing, but with the twist tonight. Hopefully we can catch some really cool stuff. Go down there and leave a like for some good luck. And we're going to get right into it, but we have to figure out how to open these sewers first. Oh, you mean business. Oh my God, there's a roach behind you. Oh my God, you scared the crap out. I thought you meant like on me. Yeah, that's right. Get out of here. This is our sewer. I see fish down there. It looks pretty good, okay? The water's deep and it looks like there's a little tunnel connecting to somewhere and we don't know where. However, we're in the vicinity, like I said, of one of my favorite spots. It's the spot we caught the red pikes at, the watermelon placos. We gotta find out how to open this thing though. Let's see, I mean, I am very muscular. I'm very strong. It is half the size of the regular ones. That's, that's true. Ah. Oh, I got it. Oh my God, it's on my toe. It's crushing me. I got it. Ooh. That was pretty easy. And this is literally the perfect size. I mean, we could fit our fish traps in there. We can net around. So I'm guessing the fish traps are going to catch way more fish than the nets. And that's because if you stick this giant net in this little, little pocket right here, most of the fish are probably just going to go into the tunnels and get scared. So I don't know how well this is going to work. But we'll see if we can get anything with my mom's pool net. We gotta be careful too to not get hit by a car because we, we're in the middle of the road. That's why we did this so late at night. It's like three in the morning. So hopefully no one's driving on this road because we're fishing, okay? This is important stuff right now. Oh my God, Helen, a fish already. What is that? Come on, be something crazy. Oh, oh my God. Is it crazy? No, it's not. It's a freaking tilapia, really. That is not what we wanted to see. However, it's not a horrible sign. That does mean that this actually does hold fish. Goodbye, my friend. That is a steep drop. I just realized if I were to fall in there, we're probably not getting me back. All right, well, let's keep going. See what else we can catch. Let me try to get this corner. We haven't hit this corner yet. So this is what I mean. I mean, if I was a, I got another fish. Like I was saying, if I was a fish in there and I saw a giant net come from outer space and abduct my friend, I would be out of there. I'd go straight in the tunnel. But this guy was not thinking that. He's not the brightest. That's a little tilapia, it looks like. Oh no, that's a bluegill. It's a little bluegill, okay. A native species, another lame one though. Okay, we're not taking this guy home. It's not what we're looking for. There he goes, buddy. Now I'm really curious to see if the one across the street has fish. So we got to scope it out a little bit. We'll see if there's any fish in this one. And then we're going to place our fish traps. This one, it looks a little shallow. There's water. It's just really nasty water. Oh yeah, that's like sludge down there. It's very polluted. Come on. I got it. Ah. Okay, that looks good. Dude, I'm excited for the fish traps. I mean, these look like perfect places to place a fish trap. See, it looks like it's ground right there and that is really shallow, but it's actually water, okay? That's just like a top layer of like nasty stuff. Let's see how deep this is, okay? That's very important. Oh, wow. 
Oh my God. Oh, it's very deep. It's deeper than the last one. Ooh, there's so much trash too. Oh yeah. Oh, there's a lot of like nasty stuff in this net. Look at this. Ew. Oh my God. Look at that. There's bottles in here. What is this? Ew. It looks like a sandwich. Someone threw their sandwich in the sewer. Ew. That's disgusting. You can't even see in the water because of all it. More trash. Oh, oh my God. Is there a fish in there? Helen, you heard that, right? There was something in it. I can't see. It's just like nasty stuff in there. Should I just dump it out? <laughs> Who's in there? <gasps> no way! No way! No freaking way! It's a baby Oscar! That is the first aquarium fish we found in these new sewers. And it was living in trash. It was living inside this bottle. So we're definitely keeping this guy. I love Oscars. One of my favorite fish in the babies. They're just so cute. I mean, he's fat and happy too. Look at, he's got some purple on him. Beautiful. All right, we're gonna fill up a bucket with some clean water. We're gonna get him in it and we're taking him home later. Look at that, there's more trash down there. There's so many bottles. Maybe there's more fish in them. Okay, now I'm excited. Little Timmy here has just proven that these new sewers are actually loaded with some really cool fish. Let's get back in there, okay? We're gonna net around a little bit more and then we're gonna place our good old fish traps. I think we're gonna place these traps here and then we have one more. We're gonna head to the other location and place it in the spot we caught the red pikes and the royal placo. So that's gonna be really fun. But for now, we're gonna keep netting around here, see what else we can find. While we're at it, we're gonna try to catch out as much garbage as we can and throw it away. Oh, there's something big in the net, it's sagging. Give me my freaking net. What is that? <gasps> oh, oh, it's a Mayan cichlid. Your favorite? No, it's not my favorite at all. My least favorite. <gasps> oh no, get back here. Stop, stop resisting. Look at that, he tried to escape me. There you go, buddy. Let's see. Oh, <gasps> do you hear that? Do you hear, oh, look at the wake. There was something big, it just came up. Well, there's definitely nothing in this bottle because it's closed. So much trash, guys, do not litter, okay? Let's get back in there. I'm gonna try a net in this corner. We haven't net in here yet. Oh, there's something big. Oh, my net is like hitting something. Oh! Ew! What, what was that? It? Helen? You what? Say something? Yeah, it's in my net. Ew, what is that? Oh my god, do you see that? It's like a snake? Looks like a snake. It's long, slender, and slimy. I kind of don't want to pull it up. I think you have to. No. It's not moving, so maybe it's not moving. What is that? Ew! Is it a fish or is it? It looks like a pipe. I think it's like a snake. Ew! Uh, oh, the. Oh! What is that? Ew! Oh my God, it looks like an eel. Oh, it's definitely dead though. It's not moving. What the heck is that? <gasps> oh my God. That's the grossest thing I've ever seen. Ew, it feels like a, it feels like a catfish. Ew, look at the mouth. Is that the mouth? Oh my God. What did we just catch? It's got like a freaking Demogorgon head. I really, I don't want to touch it. It's dead, right? I mean, feel it. It's like disgusting. Absolutely not. <laughs> Maybe it's like a big worm. Oh, Helen, it has eyes. What do you think it is? I don't know, it's disgusting though. Look, it's got eyes right there. We just found an alien in the sewer, okay? There's some crazy stuff in there. I wish, I kind of wish it was alive. We could take him home. We, we would have a pet Demogorgon. Look at its teeth. They're zooming on the teeth. They're huge. Oh my oh God. My, it's got like a bajillion teeth. I'm not even kidding right now. I've, I have no clue what that is. And I, I mean, what if it's like a new species that we just discovered? It's disgusting. It literally looks like an alien. That is out of this world. Okay, well. I think we caught like the Alaskan bullworm. What is that? The people will know. Please comment down below if you know what that is. I'm sure you guys do. That is why we put nets in there and we put fish traps. We're always catching out stuff I didn't even know existed. I really want to catch one that's alive. I mean, how crazy would that be? It looks like an eel. That is like the grossest thing we've ever caught, like by far. What are you gonna do with it? Should we just put him back in the sewer? I guess. Oh, it smells so bad too. <laughs> okay, buddy. Oh my, oh god. my god. I mean, it looks like it would live in a sewer, so it makes <laughs> sense. Let's keep going. Hopefully we don't catch another one of those. What is that? Those are possums. They're possums? Come here. Get back here. <laughs> Get back here. Hey, hey, stop right there. Stop. Oh my god. Look at that thing. It's another alien. Okay, we'll leave you be, I'm sorry. Okay, Helen, you're real funny. I just looked up Alaskan bullworm because I was curious as to what it was. And it's from SpongeBob. <laughs> it's a made up cartoon. All right guys, so far we've caught one Oscar out of here, one normal fish, but I'm gonna be honest, okay? I kind of don't want to keep fishing in that one after what we just pulled up. So we're gonna go back across the street. That thing's gonna give me nightmares. I mean, literally. We're back in this one. Come on, give me something good. Oh my God. It's not the same blue, yo, buddy. What are you doing? Um, there's a car coming. Oh, no mind us. Just finding new species. <laughs> Ooh, look in there. Oh, there's actually a lot of fish. Oh, I just saw a bunch right there. Come on. Maybe you'll catch an arowana. Oh, baby Placo. Oh my God. Oh, it's not a normal one though. Do you see that? It's got like gold spots on it. Oh my God. It's so tiny. 
That's so adorable. I've caught these before in a tunnel. Oh, look at his little lips. There's another car coming. Oh my God, run. Oh, that's security. Okay. Nothing to see here. We got ourselves a little bitty Playco. I think that's called like a, a meatball. No. Not meatball? A, a snowball. It's a meatball. It's a snowball Playco, not a meatball Playco. We're going to add him to the bucket with the Oscar. We should probably throw our fish traps in there real quick. Just so if we do get kicked out, we could still have the traps always coming back. We will still have the traps to come back to later. It looks like someone took a chunk out of his fin. You see that? Come on, give me something good. Oh yeah, that was a good net. What? Another one. Another alien. Really? Yes, I'm not kidding. It's not this. Oh my God. This one's all curled up. And we know it's not the same one because it's a different sewer. What is going on? Did you hear that? Something just came up there. Another fish just came up to the top. What is going on? Uh, this is very disturbing. This one's fat. Look at it. It's all curled up too. It's like stiff. Look at it. It's stiff. <laughs> that is its mouth. Ew, and there's its eyes. That's so vile. That is a literal alien out of the sewer. Their teeth are orange and they're like huge. What should we do with this one? Throw him back? We'll just toss him back, I guess. We got my signature one right here. This one means business, okay? We always catch some insane stuff. And then we have the mediocre one, okay? This is the only other one I have, so we'll make do. And these have been marinating in the back of my truck for about two days. That's disgusting. Yes. All right, we got a little piece right here. We're gonna dip it in the trap. There we go, there goes one piece. There it goes, in the trap. Let's get these guys in the sewers. I'm very excited, okay? Not only are these new spots, but they're completely different, you know, sewers that we normally fish. So I cannot wait to see what we pull out of here, guys. Let's do it. Okay, guys, time to throw down the first fish trap. Here we go. There goes the trap. Oh, that looks good. It's the perfect fit. We got this one tied to a rod. We'll leave it here. You know what I think is funny? Security drove past us two times already. Windows down, looking directly at us. I mean, he sees that we have lifted up the sewers. He also waved at you. Yeah, he waved at me. So I think we're in the clear. We're good to go, baby. We're gonna drop the second trap into the sewer. There it goes. Oh, my rope is not long enough. I'll just tie it to the grate and it shouldn't go anywhere unless one of those alien creatures decides to use his magical powers. <laughs> There He's got go. magical powers now? <laughs> yeah, I mean, probably. All right, there we go. Fish trap is set. I am very excited. I, I know I've said it like a million times, but I really am. Now what we're going to do, we're going to head down the street to the ones that we've fished before and that we know there's really cool fish there. And uh, hopefully we can pull out something really cool. So let's do it, guys. Let's head to the other sewers. All right, we made it to the other spot, guys. Now on the drive here, I got a little curious and I literally, I, I typed in Demogorgon fish, okay? I don't know how else to describe it. And I think we found what it is. You look at the second image there and that's that's what it is right that's gotta be it it's called a demigorgon fish i mean i was joking that's literally look demigorgon it says demigorgon that's what it is oh okay so they're called lampreys look at these things okay now i actually kind of want to catch a live one so we can have one as a pet it says it's a parasitic fish so it like leeches and sucks on other fish and and kills them so maybe we don't want to have one as a pet oh <gasps> Oh no, look at that. Okay, yeah, never mind. We don't want to catch one. That's crazy, dude. They're in the sewers, too. We're going to hop out right now, start netting in these other sewers where we know there's cool fish, and then we're going to place a fish trap. And yeah, guys, this might be a crazy night. There's some crazy stuff in the sewers. All right, this is the honey hole right here. I cannot tell you how many fish we've pulled out of this sewer. We haven't been here in a little bit, so I'm really excited to see what we can get tonight. So we're going to stick the net. What the heck? There's a crab, Helen. A crab? Yeah, there's a little crab. I think that's a crab. He's right. Oh my God, here, I'm gonna grab him. Please don't get scared, buddy. Oh God. <laughs> Ew, there's a spider on me. Is he still there? Can you see him? Here's a, ow! He's on the way. I got him. Ow! You got it? Ow! Ow, he's pushing me! Ow, it's a crab! He's last on. It's like, purple. Oh my God, it's purple. What just happened? Ow! What is going on tonight? We just caught a crab in the sewer and he pinched me. It's not just a crab, it's a purple crab. That's right, it is purple. What? I've never seen a purple, okay. Relax, buddy, you've gotten enough. It's a purple crab, you guys. I didn't know that was a thing and it's, Guys, this is freshwater. This is a freshwater crab. I don't, I don't know what's going on. That's really cool, we should keep him. Like literally, it's purple. Oh, he's doing pull-ups. So pretty here. He's doing pull-ups. We should definitely keep them. Guys, once again, please comment down below what is going on. But I'll take it, okay? We're gonna add him to the bucket. I think it was worth getting pinched because we caught him and now we can have him as like a little pet crab. That's really cool. Ow! <laughs> oh, he pinched me again. Ow, ow, he's got me again. He's got me again. Let go. Oh, that really hurts. Let go. There he goes into the bucket, our little pet crab. <laughs> Is it like a full moon tonight? I mean, why is so much weird stuff happening? Pet crab secured. We're gonna get the net in there now. Start scooping and see what we can catch. All right, 
let it begin. Oh, this one's a lot deeper than those other ones. What did we get? Nothing. <laughs> That's how it goes. You're not gonna catch something every scoop, okay? Oh, was that security? Now, right after we began netting, security kicked us out, but we weren't gonna take no for an answer after catching that crazy purple crab. Oh, okay. Thank you. Yeah, we'll leave. We're not leaving. We just caught a crab. Purple crab. So then this happened. Okay, guys, I said I wasn't leaving. Oh, I didn't leave. He's chasing us. He's chasing us right now. That's security. The high speed chase. We just wanted to catch some fish. Okay, guys, I'll be honest. So what happened, right? He ordered us to, wow, he's getting close. So what happened, okay? He ordered us to leave. I said, okay, but we were catching some cool stuff, so I, I didn't want to leave. So what we did, we acted like we left, and then we, we turned off our headlights, okay? And then we like snuck back in there. However, he was also waiting there without his headlights, and now he's, now he's chasing us. Look, <laughs> oh He's on us right now! Oh God! Oh, what about our fish traps? I want to keep fishing, I want to keep netting, and we have fish traps to check. So we'll find out a way and we will see you guys there. All right guys, so it is actually the next morning. Now what you saw was a high speed chase from the security guard. Now we tried our best, okay? We battled it out with him last night, but we were not able to come back and finish the video. So we're here the next morning. We're hoping he doesn't come back. We still have our fish traps and the other series to check. I'm very excited. So it kind of turned into like an overnight fish trap challenge. So hey, maybe it's worth it. Maybe we catch some really cool stuff. But right now we're back at the store. We caught that crab at the purple crab. We got a bucket and we got our net. Our netting time got cut short that night. So we're gonna net around a little bit and then go check our fish traps and hopefully we catch something cool first up we gotta fill the bucket up with some water here we go oh yeah the sewers look good today baby this better have been worth it we better catch something in here oh yeah oh that was a good scoop come on give me something oh yeah fish and it's a bluegill <laughs> that's definitely not worth it the fish are in there we're gonna send him back down let's see nice big scoop come on oh <gasps> Oh, redfish. Look at that. It's a massive Oscar. Or I say massive. It was bigger than the other one we caught last night. Oh my God, it's gorgeous. Look at the red on him. Oh my God. I've never seen an Oscar like that. That is gorgeous, you guys. Look at that. He's even got like pink and purple. And oh, that is so cool. That is two Oscars we've caught out of the sewer so far. What kind of Oscar is that? Like a tiger Oscar? I don't, I don't know. We're gonna add him to the bucket. That is awesome, guys. If there's one, there's more, okay? That's always how it goes. Here, come on, give me something. Oh, oh my God, the stick is moving. Look, that's an eel. That's an eel, baby, yes. Now, what type of eel? We don't know. What if it's one of the freaking Demogorgons? Oh my gosh, what are you? Is that a fire eel? Please tell me that's a little baby fire eel. Come on, if he has red and orange, that's a fire eel. I can't tell. Oh, he's adorable. It is a fire eel. Look at the orange tail, baby. That's a little baby fire eel. He's got like a little orange dot on his tail. Oh my gosh. Just a little baby fire eel. That is so cool. Okay, okay. Before he jumps out, let's get him in the bucket. We've been here five minutes. That's why we wanted to fish here so bad last night. There's insane fish in the sewer. Well, let's get back in there, guys. I'm very excited for the fish traps, though. Because like I said, fish traps always catch more fish than the nets. We'll keep going, get a few more nets in here, and then we'll go check those fish traps. I see fish down there. I can actually see them swimming around. I can't tell what they are, though. Ugh. Fish. Oh, another bluegill. There's so many bluegills in these sewers. These guys are little native fish. We're just gonna throw him back. See ya, buddy. Ooh, what is that? Oh my God, on the wall, on the wall. It's sucking on the wall, come on. No, no, he went down. He went over here. He's in this corner. What the heck was that? Oh, I got it. I got it, you guys, look at this. I saw this fish swimming on the wall and he eluded me two times, but I got him. I don't know what it is. Look how cool that is. Is that like a catfish? That's definitely some sort of catfish. <gasps> look at his whiskers. Oh, look at his little whisker. He's got sharp spines too. I mean, these are like rock solid. Oh, they're so sharp too. Ow, I just spined myself. Guys, what the heck is that? Comment down below. It's a little baby catfish. That's so cool. It kind of looks like a synodontist, but I've never seen one with like those patterns or those colors. Look at his little mouth. <laughs> look at that mouth. All right, we're keeping this guy for sure. Oh, that's so cute. Okay, another one just came up. That might have been the same species that was on the wall, just like this guy. Look, he's right there. Okay, let's get this guy in the bucket. We'll try to get his friend real quick. Right in this corner. It looked like the one we just caught. Oh, oh my, what is that? Is that tilapia? Oh, I think it's just a tilapia. We'll toss you back. You guys, I think this sewer is all fished out. We've been fishing here for like 30 minutes. We got some really cool stuff. We got the mystery catfish, the little baby fire eel, and the little red Oscar. Some really good stuff. I wish we could have placed a fish trap here last night, but we do have two in those other sewers that we never fished before, and we do know there's fish in there. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna pack up the bucket, head down there, check these fish traps, hopefully don't get kicked out by security, and hopefully it was worth it, guys. I'm really excited to see what's living in those. So yeah, let's do it. 
All right, guys, we're back here at our fish traps. Now, it actually looks like security closed the sewer grates, so we're gonna have to lift them back up and then check these fish traps, but let's freaking do it, guys. Leave a like for good luck. We'll see what we caught. All right, we're gonna set our bucket right there for the keepers. Hopefully there are keepers. I can see the fish trap down there. It looks like it's moving a little bit, like in the water, like little fish in there. I don't know. We're gonna check though. Uh, really sucks I have to lift these crates back up. Come on, I can do it. Ah, come on. Oh, got it. Oh, that is so heavy. Oh yeah, look down there. Oh, there was fish next to the trap too, it looked like. Oh, there's a lot of fish down there. Oh, I kind of went in that around. We're gonna pull up the fish trap though, let's do it. Come on, give me something crazy. Imagine we catch one of the lampreys, like a live one. What do we get? Oh, I hear fish. Oh, I see fish. Oh, it's looking good. We got some fish for sure. What is that? <gasps> what is that? No way. There's something crazy in here. <gasps> yes! Oh, we got some good stuff. What is this? There's like a long black fish right here. Oh, we got a little fancy Playco too, it looks like. Another, another snowball? Oh no, this one's striped. Look at that Playco, it's like a little striped one. Ooh. Okay, we gotta get these fish out, guys. We caught fish. It worked. Okay, we got a tilapia, we'll throw him back. What is this guy? Is that an Akara? Look at this. We got another Akara. Oh, that's beautiful. Look at the tail. Okay, let's get these guys in the bucket. There you go. What else did we get? Dude, is this a fish? That's a fish. Oh my God. Ew. Ew, it's so slimy. <gasps> what? Look at its tail. That is so cool, you guys. It looks like a knife fish. It looks like Abby. Did we just catch Abby's like child? There's no way. Oh my gosh, yes. Another beautiful Oscar too. Look at that, he looks so, <gasps> wait. That must mean they connect because this literally looks like his brother. Look at this. This is his brother. They're twins. They're literal twins. Oh my gosh. So that might mean these sewers actually connect to each other. So that's that's cool. That means there's definitely some good stuff in here. Another giant Akara. We'll get him in the bucket. What else do we get? Another tilapia. It looks like about it. We'll get him in the sewer. That was sick. I don't know what this is, but he's really cool. Look at that thing. <gasps> Look at his mouth. Get you back in the bucket. We got a really pretty Playco as well. And a nice little Oscar. Okay, that was a good fish trap. There's some good stuff in there this isn't my favorite one either okay my favorite one is in the other one Whew, so we're gonna go check that one and see what we caught in there but now we know these sewers hold some really cool stuff and they might actually just connect to the other ones all right guys let's go see what's in the second fish trap all right here's the second fish. i can see the fish trap it looks like fish are moving in it as well but check this out Look at this little guy that we caught, the black one. Look at the black little fish right there. He's got like a white stripe going down him. That is so cool. It looks like a knife fish, but I've never seen one with that coloration. So that's really cool. Let me know what it is. We're gonna check trap number two now and see what all we caught. Here we go. All right, there we go. Oh yeah, she's down there. Oh, I think I see one of the lampreys, like the dead ones. I really hope we caught one. Lamprey, lamprey. Let's untie it and pull it up. Here we go. Please, please, please give me something crazy. Oh, it's heavy. Oh. I feel moving around in there. It's heavy too. Come on. What did we get? Oh, oh my God. I think we did it. I think we did it. It's a lamprey. It's a lamprey. Get him in the bucket. No way. Oh, it's a fire reel. It's even better. Look at that. It's a massive fire reel. What the heck is this? Oh, it's this huge fire mouth. I've never seen one that big. Look how chunky he is. Oh, we got some good stuff in this one. Look at that. Little fire mouth. Look, look, guys, we caught a massive fire reel. I thought it was one of the lampreys. Oh, look at him. Look at him. Wait, what's wrong with his eyes? Look at his eyes, they're white. Is he like blind? Maybe he has like a cataract. Let's try to get him out of here. Come on, buddy. No way. Something weird. Oh, he's so quick. He's not too big, but it's a decent size one. It's like a juvenile. Come on, buddy. There we go, I got him. I got him, I got him. I got him, look at that. Look at his eyes. Can you see it? They're like all white. You guys, I think this fire is blind. No, oh! No, 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 no. Get in the bucket. Oh, that was a close call. We got a baby fire reel, and now we just caught a monster one. He looks blind, too. He's got white eyes. That's so crazy. I've never seen a blind fish before, but spotted so often, we'll toss him back. What else did we get? Come on. That can't all be it. Oh, another baby Oscar. This looks like the other one we caught in the bottle. He's cute. We'll get him in the bucket. Anyone else? Let's dump it out. Come on. Oh, <gasps> what the? The leaf just moved. Did you see that? Oh, my God. What is that? What is that? It's squishy, Helen. Another alien in the sewer. It looks like a leaf. Oh my, that's, what is this? It's a blob. We just caught a blob fish. Let's wash it off. What is that? Is he moving? Oh my God, is that a puffer fish? It looks like a puffer fish. What? I've never seen one like that. Whoa. Oh, that is so freaky looking. It's some sort of puffer fish, it looks like, you guys. He's so adorable. Look at his little fins moving around in there. Puffer fish, baby. I've never seen one like that. Usually we'll catch like the green and black ones. I think that might be it, dude. Oh, look. Is that a baby tadpole? <laughs> little baby, come on, buddy. Oh, look at that, he's so adorable. Little tadpole, we'll throw him back. You guys, we caught some crazy stuff in here. I mean, look at this. A blind fire reel. I mean, look at his eyes, they're all white. Comment down below what you think that's from. I think he's blind. Look at this. 
Look at his eyes. That's so freaky. Oh my gosh. Ow, he spined me. He got me good. So we got that guy. We got another Oscar, a big fire mouse cichlid, and then this, dude, look at his face. That's so cool. Wow, dude, these sewers are loaded. I'm really happy we explored these, placed some fish traps. Now we know, guys, if you want us to come back here, do a little part two in these sewers, let me know in the comments. But for now, we have a bunch of fish that we're gonna go back to my house and put into the ponds. Look at that. I think I see one of the, the lampreys. I, it might be dead, it might be alive. I see like a big eel looking thing on the bottom. I'll try and net him. Right there, I got him. Oh no, ew, oh, it's a dead one. It might be the same one. Oh Jesus. If you guys want us to come back and try to catch one of these, but alive, let me know. We'll try to make it happen. Look at this thing. Ooh, oh, look at that mouth. Look at that, that's not normal. That is so disgusting. There's some crazy stuff living in here. We'll throw him back. We'll get these sewers closed up and we'll meet you guys back at my house. Here we go. All right, guys, we've made it back to my house. We're actually starting things off here a little different. We're here at the mini pond. Oh, look, right there. There's the angelfish we caught from the abandoned house. They're doing really good. There's another one there. Oh, there's the bullfrog. He's doing good as well. And we're actually gonna be adding some of the fish that we caught today into this pond because it's looking a little bare. It could spice it up a little bit. So what we want to do, we're gonna get this guy, this little black... It looks like some sort of knife fish. Oh, he's going crazy. We're gonna get him in here, and I think he'll do perfect in all these plants. So let's add him in now. Oh, look at it. Look at him. He's like fluttering. He's like a flounder. Oh, that's so cool. Well, we might never see him again, but we'll know he's in here doing good. We're also gonna get this guy. Now, I don't know if you guys got a good look at him in the sewer, but it's like some sort of puffer fish, like for sure. And this pond is where we put all the little green ones. So I think he'll do good in here. This is so cool, guys. Comment down below what kind of puffer fish this is. Oh, look, look, there's a green one right, right there. There's a green one down there. Oh, that's so cool. We're gonna add him in now, look at him. Oh my God, that's so cool. I love puffer fishing. I've never seen that one before. We also caught this guy right here. Now that snowball pleco we caught last night, we added to this pond. There he goes. We're gonna get one more fish we caught today in the mini pond, and that's this guy. It looks like some sort of synodontist. I think he'll do great in here. We got some quarry catfish. He'll fit right in, so we're gonna add him in now. There he goes. So as you guys know, we got a giant Mata Mata turtle here at my house, and he requires a lot of food because he's a big boy. And this is his pond right here. We got lots of mollies in here, Columbus cichlids, and we always need to be adding food in here for him or else he'll just eat everything. I think he's right here. Oh yeah, here he is. Come say hello. Come say hi, Justin. Oh yeah, oh he didn't bite me this time. He's a good boy. What? Okay, oh, oh, I spoke too soon. I spoke too soon. I'm sorry. I'm just trying to give you food. My God, that thing is gnarly. Look at them. We got some really cool Cara cichlids and I think they'll do great in here. Hopefully they'll breed to create more food. Who knows, maybe it's a breeding pair and they'll breed. We're gonna add them in now. There they go. Oh yeah. Check this out guys. We also caught a little baby fly reel. He is so adorable. Look at the guppies. Oh, they're so cool. There's so many in here. We're gonna go ahead and add the baby fly reel to the crawfish jungle gym. That's where we add all the baby eels. Everyone's doing good in here. Now we also caught a monster one, as you can see. So we're gonna add a few fish to the mystery pond and then we're gonna get the big fly reel in the front pond with the other ones. All right, now we're here at the mystery pond. Check it out. Look at the koi coming up. We're gonna add some of the cichlids we caught today in this pond. Look at this, we got a bunch of Oscars, a big fire mouth. Look how cool that is, that fire mouth is huge. And these Oscars are gorgeous, so we're gonna add them in there. Hopefully those Oscars get bigger and one day we can add them to the Oscar army. We also got one more, the one we caught last night we also added to this pond, so there he goes. And last but not least is this massive blind fire reel. We're gonna add them into the front pond with all the other ones. Now there might be some of the fire reels in this pipe, let's see if we can find them. We got a bunch in this pond, I think there's like six or seven. Oh, 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 what is that? Oh, there's a fire reel. Oh, <laughs> there was one of them. And we got a. Oh, oh no, oh no. Well, um, he's in the pond now. Those things are literally impossible to hold, but he's in there. He should do good. I don't know how he eats because he's blind, but maybe he just like smells the food. Who knows? We'll see how he does. But that was insane, guys. Exploring those crazy new roadside sewers today. I've always wanted to do that and it actually produced some really cool fish. So if you want me to go back, maybe catch one of those crazy lampreys, a live one, go down there and leave a like if you did enjoy. Subscribe down below. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.